Then and now, Fremont Street. John Miller opened Hotel Nevada in 1906 after having a tent hotel that was called Hotel Las Vegas. Some of the rooms at Hotel Nevada were 10 feet by 10 feet and cost $1 per night, and the hotel got the first telephone in town, telephone number one. The Hotel Nevada, after many additions, is still standing today as the Golden Gate Hotel and Casino. The city was founded in 1905, but was incorporated in 1911. One year after this photo was taken, Fremont Street was the first street in the city to be paved in 1925. Six years later, in 1931, the gambling ban was repealed in Nevada after being in place since 1910. This is where the Fremont Street Experience Canopy begins on the east side. The J.C. Penney store on the left is where the D Casino is currently located. Hotel Apache opened in 1932 with the first electric elevator in Las Vegas. In 1951, Benny Binion bought the El Dorado Club and Hotel Apache and opened Binion's Casino, which was the first casino to replace sawdust-covered floors with carpet. Binion's was also the first to offer free drinks to all gamblers, and it is where the World Series of Poker began in 1970 with seven invited players. This photo is from 1939. One year earlier in 1938, Las Vegas banned all saddled horses from entering any casinos. The El Cortez opened in 1941 as the first luxury resort in Las Vegas. In 1951, the teal signage was added, and since then the exterior is nearly the same. Because of that, in 2013, the El Cortez became the only active Las Vegas casino on the National Register of Historic Places. The Golden Nugget opened in 1946 with a Gold Rush theme. In 1973, Steve Wynn became the majority owner and youngest casino owner in Las Vegas. Wynn added the first hotel tower in 1977, and other hotel towers were added in 1984, 1989, and 2009. In 1945, the Chamber of Commerce created the Vegas Vic character for marketing purposes. Six years later, in 1951, Vegas Vic started hanging out at the Pioneer Club, greeting visitors every 15 minutes. Howdy, partner. Welcome to downtown Las Vegas. Vegas Vicky kicked her leg up in 1980 on top of the Glitter Gold sign. Vegas Vic and Vegas Vicky got married in a formal ceremony in 1994. But Vicky was taken down in 2017 to make way for Circa, which opened in 2020. Vicky was moved inside Circa next to her bar called Vegas Vicky's. Mm -hmm.